The vineyard has been in, it's an estate that's been in my family for over 150 years. My mother and I are now the fourth and fifth generation of women managing the estate, so I think the a bit of a matriarchy because before it was my grandmother, before it was two great aunts. I'm very close to my grandmother. Um, she, uh, someone who shared her her passion for for Savigny and wine growing and gardening also since I was a little girl. Working with my mother has been interesting. I, um, it's uh, I think created a new. Uh, another level of another relationship with her. It's actually really probably the most, the thing I didn't know when I, we started, because she had just started taking over from my grandmother, that she's a great winemaker. <laughs> so the Loire Valley is, uh, you have Paris, which is here, and Nantes, which is in Brittany on the Atlantic coast, and uh, so it's in northwestern France. What's interesting with Chenin Blanc is uh, you can make a dry, off-dry, sweet and sparkling wines. There are different expressions of that grape, be it from Vouvray, which is closer to Tours, and uh, our region, which is Sauvignon. Typically, Sauvignon wines were known to be very steely and austere, which was true for, for decades. I think now uh, wines are, have more fruit and can be drunk in their youth, whereas before you had to wait 10 years and open it five days in advance to be able to drink the wine. Sauvignon wines are like uh, white burgundies. They can age for 10, 20, 30, 40 years. Then it's a matter of, of taste. Some people uh, like, uh, some people don't, but I, I personally think they're beautiful.